to Matt and Vic Productions. We recently made this creepy corpse prop for the Cannibal Orchard Spooky Wagon Ride out of a rather cheap and cheesy plastic skeleton. How cheap and cheesy? This cheap and cheesy. Not very scary. So I will show you how we turned this into this. For the body, I used the shrink wrap technique, also known among haunters as corpsing. If you want more ideas, there are lots of good videos out there about this technique. I started by wrapping the body in clear plastic drop sheets. I then used a heat gun to shrink wrap the plastic and melt it to the bones, giving it a dried, withered, desiccated flesh look. Then I spray painted it with beiges, browns, and black. If you are going to do this, be sure to use spray paint for plastic. I did this a few more times to build up texture. For the head, I used a different technique that allowed me to sculpt features. If you are going to do this, you will need some inexpensive latex caulking, some ammonia, and some paper towels. I also recommend you have some disposable gloves, work in a well-ventilated area, and use a respirator. I ripped the paper towels into small pieces, making sure there were no straight edges. I thinned the latex caulking with the ammonia until it was about the consistency of paste. I then dipped the paper towels into the caulking and laid it on the skull. Once I was satisfied with how it looked, I let it dry and painted it. I then added some crepe hair using spray adhesive and glued some doll eyes into the sockets. If it was a prop that was going to be seen in a place of prominence, I would have given it eyelids and teeth. But this corpse is going to lay in a dark crypt in a haunted house. So that is how I turned this into this. Thank you for watching.